Good evening guys, welcome to the video. I'm Davo, welcome to the channel. So today we're going to be doing uh, Katmandu heat pouches. So I, um, a couple of weeks ago you might have seen I went uh, to the bush and one of, one of my mates, I have seen these before and now I remember, but years ago just very briefly. And um, anyway, one of the boys had these in, in his ute and he showed me them and just awesome. So I had to get me one and uh, they're just going to be awesome. So um, you got to check them out. If you're into cold camping or keeping warmer for any uh, intended reason so um, I went away and I, um, I actually took a sleeping bag it was a summer one and I didn't take too much it was really hot so I took my shorts and I took you know um, a jumper and I didn't take too much stuff and a, a spare t-shirt and some socks so I went and um, all of a sudden in the middle of the night the temperature temperature changed and fuck it was so cold it was and that's what brought these up in the car he says oh shit you should have had one so um i was like shit i'm gonna get me some of those anyway so um that was the issue and i couldn't believe in the middle of summer how cold it was in the bush it was quite weird i actually thought it was gonna be real hot and i wasn't gonna need you know too much warmth but in that morning it started getting a little bit dewy and a little bit cold so it was quite crazy but then straight after that, a couple of hours after that, when the daylight hit, it was fucking bang. It was uh, hot as again into the 30s. So I think it was. It was at least 30 degrees. And um, even out in the uh, outskirts of the bush there, where it verges onto the forest, it was about, uh, it would definitely have been about 33 degrees, I'd say. It was it was crazily hot down there. So anyway, getting on to the uh, thing. So we're just going to test them out. So make sure this video is not too long they have a metal tab in them they are made of um what are they made of there's something uh sodium acetate and a metal disc um they're reusable um fit perfectly in your pocket as they're called pocket hand warmers i got them from katmandu uh 1995 new zealand um not sure where you can get them throughout any other um throughout the world but i'm sure that if you went on to if you're in another country and you went on to Kathmandu site, they would send shipping all around the world. Um, what else? Yeah, so um, they're just awesome. It rises up to 55 Celsius. So this is just get it, and we'll get into it, and then we'll uh, go through the process and how you reuse them. So what you do is there's a little metal tab, as I said, in there, and you get that metal tab, and we'll just put it up there, and then you flip that. Check this out. It's like this crazy... Um, chemical reaction starts when you um flick this metal tab apparently okay that's just strange apparently let's keep trying it now look check this out maybe oh no here we go guys maybe pull it back a bit it's filling up, check it out. It's turning into crystal. And now she's as hot as crap. So check them out, that's cool. Still getting hotter. And I'm ready to chuck into your pocket. Catman do ham warmers. Gotta be good out in the old forest, hiking, hunting, out in the boat, at work on a cold day. If you're a builder out in the site, chuck them in your pocket. Two pockets, mate. I tell you, you'll be warm as toast. Then chuck the billy on, chuck her in, recharge it, and all it takes is five minutes to boil these in some water, and um, you're good to go again. So we'll get into the boiling and the uh, water process. Meet you there. Okay, guys, we've got the pack on the stove. Bring it to the boil. We want to sit that in there for about five minutes or ten minutes until the pack goes back to liquid form. And then after it's gone to a liquid form, we want to sit it out on a bench for about ten to fifteen minutes. <laughs> 